thank you, Uncle Cy, for being willing to be a part of this. Hey, and, my uh, pleasure, man. How many years were you in the military? I actually served for 24 and a half years, <clears throat> and I spent half of that, okay? 12 years in Europe. If, if you don't have somebody in your family that's involved in the military, okay, the general public does not have any idea of what a person that serves goes to or what the family goes to. Mm -hmm. God gave me the platform with the show, Duck Dynasty, okay, and I, our whole family does it. You know, that's a place for us to stand up and okay, and, and say something about, hey, look, you need to honor those that serve this country. Freedom, you know, there is no such thing as free. Nothing's free, okay? Somebody somebody always had to do the work and pay the bill. Look, we're the ones that sent them there, sent them to war, then we need to have their back going going over to war and then have it coming back, you know? Because, I mean, you know, it's a debt. We owe the debt to the veterans and those that serve, okay? We owe them a debt that we can't pay. They've put my name and my uniform and stuff in a museum up here in Monroe, okay? Well, you deserve that, okay? So does every, every man and woman that's ever put the uniform on should have their own museum, okay? All of, all of them should have it. I don't even know how to put that in words. You lost two legs, okay? And you started a foundation, okay, of honoring the sacrifice. Okay, so this is personal, and it's even on a, it's even on a, a higher level than that. Don't think I could tell America, don't forget. You know, my goodness, don't forget the men and women that have died for this country. But anyway, appreciate your service, appreciate your sacrifice. Thank you for your time, Officer.